Uh, from one extreme to the other in back-to-back -back months. This January will mark the second driest January on record after we got slammed with storms in December. CBS 13's Shante Passmore is live at Beals Point Beach off Folsom Lake, getting answers about the impact to our water supply right now. Shante. Well, hopefully. School, but there's some concern if this dry spell doesn't end, our region could be in trouble. December snow in the Sierras packed a punch, leading to thousands without power. And some may be wondering if that made a dent in our water supply. So CBS 13 asked that very question to the National Weather Service. In short, it did help. Last October's precipitation also made a difference. So between both storms, they made up roughly 80% of the precipitation for this water year, which is above normal so far, but the National Weather Service says it's not seeing much chance as a precip until the middle of February. So far, we're doing okay halfway through this water season, but conditions will have to change. So we really need to get at least two more big storms this season, I would say, uh, to get us to where we need to be uh, water storage wise. CBS 13 is learning that if we get those two big storms, that will help us finish the year normal. So the bottom line, the best case scenario is the status quo would remain, meaning we'd still be in a drought. No, we definitely are keeping our fingers crossed for some rain and some snow as well. All right. Thank you, Shantae.